What's up guys, gonna give you an unboxing today, but first I wanna kinda of show you what's going on with my Mark 18. Uh, here it is, everything that's on it right now, as you can see, pretty bare. I got rid of most everything. The rail covers are gone. Kinda like the look of the uh, bare rail there. I uh, got rid of the M600C uh, setup with the dual switch, so I'm switching to a different light. You guys will see that uh, in the future. So here's that, no optic. And that's what I'll be unboxing right now, It's the optic. Ordered this, or well I didn't order it, I bought this off a guy on AR15.com. Uh, pretty excited to get it. But a uh, little side note, pretty much done with uh, replica optics. Uh, I'm just not happy with pretty much anything that I've tried as far as replicas go. I know a lot of people are and that's fine, but I don't know, I guess I have expensive tastes or I like good quality things, so decided to get something a little bit higher end in that regard. So, let's see what we got in here. Alright, EOTech, kind of the standard packaging that most of them come in with the clamshell box. Slide that off, then here's the box again. Pretty neat packaging, I think kind of keeps your uh, purchase safe and secure in there. So you can see, got the EXPS3 uh, 30 in tan. So let's open this up, if we can figure out how. I have no idea how to open this. Oh, here we go. All right, so here we have the operator's manual. Just normal stuff there, so we're gonna skip that for now. And then here we have the site itself. Kind of housed in there, looks really nice. Go ahead and set this down for a second. Close this box up. Show off the site here. Uh, I did a review or overview of the replica of this, and as you can see, uh, they did get pretty close with the replica, but uh, definitely doesn't compare like quite at all. You got a smaller battery cap here, it's uh, pretty much a smaller battery tube, and that's kind of one of the big things about the replicas that I didn't like was how big the tube was for the battery. So, let's see if we can get this opened. Actually, probably need to use my tool for that. There might be a battery in here, I'm not sure. Ah, uh, yep, there was. All right, so we'll just close that back up and test it out. All right, so as with pretty much any EOTech, you kind of just turn on with either the bottom or up. See if we can get this thing in focused. Definitely gets very bright. Um, NV doesn't really do anything. I'm pretty sure it makes it a very, very faint. Uh, so that we can't see it, but under night vision you should be able to see it just fine. So no real way to test that, but definitely a very cool sight. Very adjustable. So we're going to get this mounted onto my Mark 18.
perhaps. All right, there it is. The uh, EOTech EXPS 3.0 on my VFC Mark 18. Definitely very cool. I'm glad I'm going back to the EOTech setup. I did have the replica on here before, and I did like it a lot, but as you know, I didn't really, wasn't a huge fan of how the replica looked, but now that I have a real one, it uh, definitely looks very nice. So uh, you guys will see more of this in the future. Uh, thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe.